Are you sure? So where do you stay at night, or where do you stay during the day? Um, in Denton. Where at? Like what general area? Um, like if we work tomorrow, if we, if we go out and look for you tomorrow, where are we going to find you at? Um, hey, thanks for all you do, by the way. We appreciate you. The park, I'll say Stanton Park. Stanton Park, okay, so here's the deal. So every Tuesday, the people from the county come out. OC Health, they wear the blue shirts. Have you seen them? Um, they come out every, they come out in the white cars. And they, oh, yeah. they talk to yeah, you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they're here every Tuesday. Mm -hmm. And then tomorrow, my guys are out with CityNet. They go throughout the city and they offer outreach services. So okay. that if you're in the park tomorrow, they will talk to you. Okay. And they will offer you services. Okay. So if you're interested in getting help, they will offer it to you tomorrow. I have a lady uh, that's working on that stuff for me. I, you know, so, yeah. You know okay. what about time they'll, they'll be there? Or? They start at 10 a.m. and they go all day long. Do they start in the stent, the park here, or where do they? So what happens is, so I have two deputies that are assigned as a community enhancement team, and their job is, in addition to doing outreach, they do specific problem areas throughout the city, and that's what they they focus on. And we work directly with CityNet, and once a week, every Wednesday, they get the CityNet girls, and they go out, because the deputies know where the homeless populations are at, and they will take them to them, and it's strictly for outreach. The so girls will make contact with them, they'll yeah. offer them services, yeah, yeah, yeah. and put get them into services if that's what they desire. Yeah, and I've worked with CityNet for mm -hmm. years now. Yeah, we're contracted with them. So. Yeah, but do, when, I guess, what's the pattern though? Where are they gonna be at what time, I'm not sure? They, they will hit all over the city. Okay. So they always go through Stanton Park because we always have homeless that are in yeah. Stanton Park. Yeah. So they every every week they go through Stanton Park. Is there a certain window that they're usually there? Or you're not sure? They'll, they usually start, because they start here at the station, that's where they pick the girls up, mm -hmm. and then they'll head out. So they usually will go through Stanton Park and first? head out throughout the city. So they'll hit Stanton so, Park first. Okay. Yeah. So about and 10 I can hit them up tomorrow morning and tell them to make sure to go look for them. Okay. Do you have a card or anything? I don't have any CityNet cards on me right now. Or do you, for your, for your I number? I don't have mine. Um, I can take I can it down. My, you want me to give you my email address? That's sure. That's get a hold of me. Well, yeah. This is, yeah. Okay. You just write it on there, I guess. Well, what is it? Okay. So it's N L Wilson at OCSD.org. Okay. So that's my email address. I'm constantly checking my email. That's the okay. best way to get a hold of me. Okay. And I'll respond to you. Okay, cool. So if awesome. you want, it's up to you if, if tomorrow, for some reason, they don't contact him or you're in contact and you want me to send the guys over, yeah. shoot me an email yeah. and okay. let me know where you're going to be and I'll okay. make sure they go over and make contact. Perfect. And awesome. then you also know Illumination Foundation is across the street, right? So yes. You can walk in over yes. there. Yes, sir. So you always have that option to go talk to them. Okay, so, so he walks over there. Can they c connect him with something? Or yeah, okay. Yeah, they're open during the day. Yeah. So you just walk in the yeah. Illumination yeah, Foundation. Okay. All right. So um, a couple of <clears throat> options. Go ahead. Is there uh, some uh, avenue I could take to get that squashed without you know? Hopefully. So you know that there is a for people that have financial hardships, there is a, a different route you can go through the court system. So you can show up at the court, tell them you're unable to pay the ticket, okay. and then the judge can make the ruling that, you know what, you can't pay it and they can make it go away. Oh, they can, okay. So that's that's up to the, the judge. Do they cite you for the municipal code violation or they cite you for the H or the uh, BMP? You said you got one for a shopping cart, right? Yes, so there's two different, there's a business professional code, there's also just an SMC. Hold on. He gave me a Saturday court date. I, I thought that was kind of strange. So this actually gets prosecuted by the city attorney. So same thing, you still have to show up in court, okay? And then okay. you can make your arguments to the judge that you're unable to pay the ticket, okay. and then the judge is the one that can take care of that. Because okay. they have an alternate court um, for the people that are unable to pay. Like a homeless, like a homeless court? Thing? Homeless court, right. Okay. So they'll be able right. to, the judge will be able to take care of that for you. Okay. And you, you, might, can, you might give me another date right. to go see them? Right. Oh, okay. So but that is your option. Just remember that you got it for a shopping cart because you're not allowed to possess shopping carts in Stanton. It's it's yeah. a violation of California law and it's a violation of Stanton Municipal Code. Yeah. And the city is very big on not having shopping carts. So yeah. if you need something to carry your stuff, get a different type of cart. Just don't use a business-owned shopping cart. Yeah. Well, I was wounded. I told the officer uh, that I was wounded. I go, I'll take it back right now. I just used it to take my property off the centralized parking lot. And then I was going to three. Yeah, it's uh, the the city is very big on not having shopping carts because it used to be a very large problem here. Yeah, and so we had to find a way of 
of getting rid of that problem because we had shopping carts all over the place that were being taken from businesses. Yeah. Okay. So, well, yeah. All right. So we'll uh, we'll reach out, make contact with you tomorrow, and we'll see if we can get you into a shelter. So what do you do if you have a court date that's not that's on a Saturday? You can always go to the court beforehand. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? You can go down to West Court and you can talk to them. You don't have to wait till your court date. You can go down yeah, there so and talk to them. Okay. All right. Thank okay. You for talking to me. Appreciate no problem. Really we'll uh, we'll find you tomorrow. All right. Okay, great. Stanton Park. Yeah. All right, during the day. Yeah. Okay. And what's your name? Joel. He has Joel a phone what? number too. Rookie. Maybe you want to call. What's that? Joel Rookie. Rookie. Yes, sir. Maybe you should give me your phone number so they, they could call you even. Hold on. Let me. Yeah. No idea. Yeah. Make it easier to reach you. Mm -hmm. We're in the 21st century, right? Yeah. R O O K I E? No, K E Y sir. R O O K E Y. Yeah. So let's just pray that he gets in the housing he needs soon. I'm so glad that he was able to make it to this meeting and talk to this sheriff anyway. So, yeah, let's pray for that. Somebody in the shelter and get them off the street. That's yeah, that's, that's great, our, isn't it? That's beautiful. plan number one. Yeah, it's beautiful. You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, you know. unfortunately, there's a lot of people out there that don't. Yeah, they won't. Not they really. don't want help, and yeah. those are the ones that cause problems for the people that do want help. Yeah, exactly. Because everyone gets lumped into the same group. Exactly. Exactly. So. Joel's an exception, thank God. Yeah, trying to get out of this. We can to help you out. <laughs> so you, if we can get you uh, into some shelter through the holidays, that'd be great. Eventually, yeah, longer yeah, yeah. on the streets, right? Be, Definitely gonna happen. Be a nice Thanksgiving present for him. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. You guys, are my, you guys are my heroes, man. You are. <laughs> oh, please share the video. Do join homeless advocates for Christ on Facebook. We're gonna keep talking to some people here. But thanks for your prayers and support. May God bless you all as you seek first His kingdom always. Bye.